I hit a drum. We visited an HIV support care center called TASO, which offers care for people infected with HIV. I'm a dance again. Yeah. He was like, where's the band? Don't nobody greet you like that in America. They be like, yeah, what's up, man? TASO is trying to help people who have AIDS to live like Eleanor, to say, I have this disease, I'm going to die, but I can live my life to the fullest. These are people who are going from town to town, telling people how to avoid getting AIDS and what to do if they have it. It's making use of what you have. You don't have medicine, so you're going to explain to people how to live as positively as, you know, the human spirit will allow. They put on a small assembly show for us where there are different speakers, different narratives given, and even songs sung. I asked once, you know, I asked, you know, how do these people have such a passion about this subject? And I was told, well, actually, all of these workers are HIV positive themselves. These people in front of me, these heroes, are all going to die. I've been to Tasso before. One of my favorite singers is this girl, Grace. A beautiful girl, beautiful voice. And I was looking at her this time, I was thinking, she looks weak, she doesn't look well, and I heard later that she got out of bed to come and sing for us. People just sometimes need to be given a chance to get up off their knees and walk and then run. <coughs> Event that they was giving us in a prayer. You mind bowing your heads, please, this. Lord, thank you, Lord, for introducing us to these special people and bringing us together today. We have to do all we can to help one another. Give us strength. Amen. That's the most precious thing we can do. These are our heroes of the community. We can't let them die. They think they can't afford to live. We're saying we can't afford to let them die. How can it be too expensive to save a life? I, I mean, I really, what, you know, what, what price are you going to put on a life? These are AIDS activists. These people are, are heroes to me. It's strange to hear the words of your own song come back and mean something completely different than the way you wrote them. But actually it'd be maybe even more powerful. People had so much faith and so much strength. You know, they were singing songs and all the stuff they was going through was like a family praying for strength, you know. Experience that much love in my life. I mean, in my own in my own country, I got a lot of love, but in Ethiopia, they they start bowing down. I'm like, oh, hey, whoa. You think you know, but you have no idea. This is fight for your rights. The diary of Bono and Chris Tucker, aiding Africa.